they really deserve to get paid a little more. I, I, I love them. They go through a lot. Monica Ferris knows the hardship of being a frontline worker during a pandemic. The food service employee says the cashiers at her local Vons deserve a pay boost to help them during these unprecedented times. Today, the LA City Council introduced a motion to have the city draft an ordinance to require grocery stores with 300 or more employees to pay their staff a hazard pay of an extra $5 an hour during the pandemic. Councilman Mitch O'Farrell, one of the co-authors of the proposal, said workers still need to be supported until we're out of this pandemic. We want to make sure as a city that we can give protection, protections to our own workers. I mean, this has been going on now for nine months. Um, some of the grocery chains were doing hazard pay initially and they stopped by late spring or early summer. Long Beach city leaders have already given the green light to require grocery companies to pay employees an extra $4 an hour for at least 120 days to compensate for the dangers they face serving the public. A worker we spoke with says he's thankful for the raise he'll be getting. I'd like that. I definitely feel like it's deserved uh, due to the fact that we are, you know, essential workers front of the line, you know, in stores with a lot of people. Sales are up on average 15% according to some studies in our grocery stores. So the profits are there more than ever. And uh, a lot of that should go to the to the workers there. O'Farrell recognizes our region has some of the highest COVID-19 case infection rates in the country, which puts essential workers at a high risk. People we spoke with say frontline workers deserve extra financial support during these tough times. The LA City Council is on recess and will resume next month. They plan to have an ordinance in place by the end of January. Reporting in Studio City, Candace Crone, KCAL 9 News.